Hello, in this short video, I'm going to show you how the HP ALM integration works with WorkSoft Certify. In this first video, part one, I'll show you how you can actually run a Certify process out of HP ALM. The key features are we can actually execute Certify processes directly from HP ALM. Um, it's very convenient to do. You can literally do a right click from within Certify, and we will automatically push your um, Certify process into a test plan. At that point, once it's in a test plan, you can run it from there. You have availability to do reporting and defect management on those running processes. Um, the other thing you can do is you can actually review all the results of the run from within HP. So ALM test labs have results. All the details about the running are stored there, and this will help with auditing. This really gives nice traceability across your reporting. Um, in addition to this, we do have integration directly from Certify Results to push defects into Quality Center. Here in Certify, I have a process. What I'm going to do is use the right-click menu, and I'm going to actually push and build a test over into Quality Center. I click Connect, and I'll get a list of my test plans. Okay, I can see there's a folder for ALM tests and different folders available. Click, click OK. And the certified process has now been pushed over there. Let's go look. If I navigate to my test plans, HP ALM, open this up, I'll actually see my ServiceNow test. So this test was automatically created by Certify, pushing the information into the test plan area of HP. At this point, I can then create different test labs and run these. So you can see I have multiple tests available here. The creation of the test lab is pretty much standardized. In my case, I have a set here for Execution Manager. I have an SAP instance, I have my ServiceNow test, and I have some that have um, multiple runs. So I have one lab, the test set contains multiple certified tests. All these can be run directly from HP Quality Center. So if we now I'm in ALM, what I'm going to do is click Run Test Set, and I can run, and it will take over. What happens is ALM will communicate, it will then take the test, request certified to run it, and the results will be saved back into my Quality Center. You can see I've logged into the SAP GUI, my test is running. It goes through my different processes, and I can see it's ended now. So at this point, my test is run, and I've got some statuses. So let's go over back into Quality Center and see what we see. I can see here the test is run, but it failed. Okay, so for traceability, I would expect to see all these results at my test level here. So I can see every test step shows up here, um, all the details of the test step level of what's happened. In this case, the incorrect value was found, so we didn't get this process, the processing status of correct, so it failed the test. If I come to my test runs, I'll get a list of what's happened today. I can take the last run, I'll drill into it. I'll go ahead and open up this window a little larger. I can see here all my test steps. So each step in the certified process is represented in the results here. I can see the bottom one, the text, and I can get a JPEG of that. So I can see it identified that the word incorrect was here versus correct. That's why the test failed. So in addition to the details of the step level, if I look at my attachments, what I'll see is I'll get a business process procedure report. So here I can see the documentation with details about the environment and the tests that ran, the details of what data was entered on different screens, and then I actually get the supporting screenshots along the way. So this basically lets us get full life cycle of authoring tests and certify, but we want to link them to test plans in HP ALM, get our lab set up, run the test sets, and get the results recorded here. This is great for people who 
who use ALM as our central area for auditing test results and working through their processes. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, you can always download the latest version of Certifying or go to our communities at worksoft.com and ask questions there.